Boom, second like a welcome back to the Austin Automates YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you how we are doing AI personalized uh, ringless voicemail drops. It's super cool because you're able to use high levels custom values and custom fields and actually swap out information before the voicemail is transcribed and then converted into voice and then dropped into the voicemail. One of the biggest use cases here is, you know, I get uh, my hair cut and every time I schedule an appointment, I get a phone call the day before, I never answer it, goes right to voicemail. And then someone says, hey Austin, just confirming your appointment for tomorrow at this salon at my time. And now we are able to remove that from the front desk person and have AI actually do that, swap out the name, the date, the location, everything. Anything that you could put inside of, of a custom field or a custom value, we're able to swap out in real time. It's super cool. You could use this for like happy birthday messages, Merry Christmas, happy holidays, and any type of long-term nurturing or appointment confirmation and have AI personalize the voicemail drop. This is how we're doing it. Let's just dive right in. Let me see, I'm gonna play one of these. So let's do this one. Hey Austin. Thank you so much for scheduling your appointment with Prospect Capo LL. I've got you all set for the 12th of January, 2025 at 245 in the afternoon. If you need to tweak the appointment time, no worries at all. Just click on the change link that I've sent over to you via text or email. Can't wait to see you soon. Boom. And like I said, it uses the custom fields to replace the name. If they put an address in or if they put a date and a time, anything, even if it's their birthday, we could set this up to where it's like, hey, we just want to wish you a happy birthday. Today's blank date. But check this out. This is how simple it is. I'm going to show you a little bit on the inner works and then I'm going to release a little bit more and I might actually give this group the very first beta access into this. No one no one has this okay no one else has this i promise you this we have been working on this for almost a year now and he and he just gave me access to the new version that is actually working okay so this is how it works basically a customer books an appointment and then what i would do is i would set a wait period but because i want to show you i want to test it out set a wait period for the day before the appointment then it sends out the message so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to go to my calendar here and i'm going to set an appointment so you guys can see january 24th at 11 30 a.m there is my first name my last name my phone number and my email address and then i hit consent and then I hit schedule meeting and then boom, of course, I'm going to get my normal, Hey, you just got a, a meeting schedule now, but the whole point of this is so that the day before the appointment, they're going to get a voicemail drop. It drops right into their voicemail and I can literally customize what number it shows up from the real, the real gold is where it shows up in the voicemail drop. Again, confirming the appointment via a voicemail drop. It shows that they get a missed call. And then iPhones now actually show what looks like a text message of a transcript. And this is how simple it is. So obviously there's the trigger. It, there's a little bit of prompting because again, right now the main use case that we're using it for is simply appointment reminders. So we do a little prompt inside of this bracket here where it says, let's make that bigger convert address into two digit sets say the same time should be this and then say everything with excitement and passion now there's a couple of things you'll see these letters here n gives it the ability to have natural language speaking this makes sure it does not read like word for word what you have written in there it'll use ai to make it sound a little bit more natural if you want it to say word for word what you're saying and then just plug in the custom fields and custom values Boom, just got a miss, just got the missed call. Now it's going to drop the, the missed message. But then if you want to have it just say exactly what your message is, I would just remove this N and then that gets rid of natural speaking. And then it's going to, then I would want to if in the prompt here, because everything right here in this green text is the prompt that's in here. And then I would want to get rid of everything that's in the brackets. But since I want to switch it up and make it make let AI decide what sounds more natural, I'll leave N. Now, language conversion is pretty sweet. Is I could put right here that I want it in Spanish, I want it in French, I want it in Polish, and it will literally transcribe the voicemail drop. So let's say you have Spanish speaking customers and you want the voicemail to show up in Spanish, we can actually do that in real time. Then we have a webhook set up. That's how the text messages go out. I'm not going to get into that right now. I just wanted to show you the, the customized voicemail drop. And then voice ID. There's a couple different custom voices that we're pulling from 
Okay, so this is what it looks like. Boom, it's, so it says iPhone transcribes now the messages and then makes it looks like it's a text message. And then when you open it, it opens it right to the voicemail. And then let's hit play. Hey, Austin. Thank you so much for scheduling your appointment with Prospect Capo LLC. I've got you all set for the 24th of January, 2025 at 1130 in the morning. If you need to switch up the appointment time, no worries at all. Just click on the change link that I've sent over to you via text or email. Can't wait to see you soon. And so it's that simple. It's literally this one web hook that goes out. So you could have it set up to sending happy birthday mess, uh, voicemail drops. You could have it set up to, to confirming like, hey, we just got your appointment or hey, your appointment's tomorrow. Um, basically everything, whatever you want the message to say would just go right in this prompt here. Um, you could have them going out on Christmas day. Hey, Jason, this is so-and-so from blank company. Just wanted to wish you a Merry Christmas. There's so many different use cases for dropping an AI powered voicemail drop into someone's voicemail. And we were trying this for like cold outreach and lead generation because you can have it drop a link in there. Sometimes it actually is good if you put the callback number in the message so they could just click the callback number. But there's so many use cases for this. But like I said, I want to drop a teaser out to this group very specifically first because I'm going to, I'm, we're just doing a couple more tests and then I'm going to be looking for some beta people to actually use this. If you have clients that have appointment-based businesses that make phone calls to confirm whether or not appointment's going to be there and they want to eliminate that task using AI and customizations. So like I said, that is it. It is an AI powered voicemail drop that can use custom fields and custom values to swap out information. So basically I could drop like, let's say I wanted to send my entire list of a thousand people a Merry Christmas and customize it. It would say, hey, Austin, hey, Jason, hey, Charlie, hey, Tracy, just wanted, this is Austin from Prospect Capo, just wanted to reach out and say Merry Christmas, hope you and your family are doing well, blah, 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 and just have an AI-powered, natural-sounding voicemail drop, and the voices are just getting better. In the future, you're actually, we're part, what, one of the things you'll be able to do is synthesize your own voice to where it actually sounds like it's you coming out. It's freaking creepy and it's awesome all at the same time. I'm so excited that I had to show you guys first. All right. So that is step-by-step step how we are doing it. We still are in beta mode. So if you would like to use this and be one of the first beta testers to use this, there is a wait list. This is how you get in. Inside of my group, GHL Blueprint, we have a list going. In the description below, there is a link to GHL Blueprint school community. It's a free community. We've got a couple, we have a little over hundred people in here and right here, I'm actually letting people register for being one of the first beta testers. So if you would like to test this and you would like to be one of the first, click the link to get into GHL Blueprint, join us inside of this group. And you, uh, like I said, I'm going to be releasing it to this group first. And, and that's step-by-step step how you get access. I look forward to seeing you guys in the group. This is going to, this is just going to be so amazing. It's going to blow things. We're, I'm, I'm so pumped about this. See you guys soon.